<laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. Um, it is that time of the month. We are doing it. I always do it wrong. We are doing Ipsy and Sephora Play. Nothing's in this bag. It's all in the box. Uh, so, just in case you didn't know, Ipsy and Sephora Play are subscription boxes. Both cost about 10 bucks plus tax, so they work out to about 11 bucks a month. Um, and you get five samples in each. So if you want to check out more of these videos, I have a playlist. I will try and link it in a card right here so you can watch the rest of them. But these are one of my favorite videos to watch every month on everyone's channels and one of my favorite to film. So let's get started. So first off, Ipsy this month. You always get a bag with Ipsy. It is like a lace look. It's not actual lace. <laughs> Yeah, right. Uh, but it's a lace, burgundy, wine-colored bag, so very fall. Um, still don't know how much I'd use it. But this month was pretty good. I'm going to start with the thing that I like the least. So I got Dermalect Nail Polish. Now, it's a full size. Or, there we go. You can see it's this, like, pearlized baby pink color. That ain't me. So I will be uh, donating that somewhere along the way. Then I got the Bye Bye Pores Pressed Powder from It Cosmetics. It comes in this cardboard thing, which is kind of flimsy. And then there's the powder, and it came with a little puff. A little, I shouldn't say a puff, a sponge. And just because my chest always seems, and my neck always seem to be shiny and I'm red anyway. I'll put a little there so you can see. Um, I really, really wanted to like this, and I mean, I'll still try it, and I'll still keep using it, but I used it one day, and it looked really, really pretty when I put it on, and then an hour later at work, I was beyond shiny, like super duper shiny. I'll say with Wouter, I sometimes get shiny a little bit later, but this was kind of next level. So, we'll see. Um, I was excited, though, to get a good brand and a good color. Then I got Hey Honey, which I feel I've gotten something from them in an Ipsy before. It's the only place I see it. And this is their Trick and Treat Active, Propo Active Propolis Cream Concealer with treatment benefits. And it's natural tone, normal to dry. I haven't tried it yet. I've pulled a little out before. Um, the color, hold on. See that little color dot down there at the bottom? I was like, ew, that's the color, that's not me. But if you look at this little tiny dot on my hand, that's the color, which is a pretty good color for me. Um, I haven't tried it, it seems really, really light, but I'll try it out soon. Then I got this really, it's from DLS, a single eyeshadow in this very uh, deep, deep, kind of coppery color. It feels kind of chalky. It swatches really pretty. I wore it the other day. Um, it's pretty, but see, look, it swatches pretty, but when you blend it out, it blends down to not much. So, I mean, something to play with, as if I don't own 800 metallic -y coffee chocolate dark colors but good sample nice wearable color so I'm okay with it and then lastly which that doesn't feel like it should be last no it is that's last okay lastly I am excited about this I haven't tried it yet but it is JM solution water luminous jelly cleanser moist and deep cleansing by by, by hyaluronic acid don't you mean with but anyway um it's a big size and I really, really like jelly cleansers. I really liked that Glossier jelly cleanser. I feel like I've tried a couple others. You can see I haven't even opened it yet. They normally seem light, but still get the job done. So I'll try and update you in an upcoming video what I thought of this, but I'm very happy. Okay, let's put it all back. That is everything for Ipsy. Now let's talk Sephora. So Sephora Play this time is all about complexion companions. So this is the bag this time. I miss the plastic bag. They really got us 
They really got us that one month with the plastic bag. The little envelope one. It was so cute. Now we're back to these. I just don't, I don't know. I never know what to do with these. But it came, hold on, sorry. I've still got all the little paper things in it, but I don't use the paper thingies. Uh, it's a pretty good month. So it came with It Bye Bye Under Eye Illumination in medium. And while this is tiny, this is going to last me a really, really, really long time. However, I've tried it twice this week and I it doesn't look good on my eye. It starts caking up and drying throughout the day and like turning a different color. I mean, I'll still try it. Maybe I can't put powder over it. I don't know. Um, then, this was kind of the most wah, wah thing of the whole thing. Uh, Sephora Triple Action Cleansing Micellar Water. All right. Like, it's just not that exciting to me. Uh, but yeah, big bot. This will last me a long time. I guess it'll be good when I travel. If I want to, if I really want to double cleanse when I travel, I can use it. So, there's that. Then, I'm going to go perfume next because I just don't care. Gucci Bloom. And if you look at it, can you see that it's already like half empty? I didn't spray any. That's how it came. Uh, but don't have high hopes. This I was excited about. This is the Sunday Riley CEO uh, Rapid Flash Brightening Serum. And so the gold standard of vitamin C to rapidly brighten the appearance of the skin and boost vital bounce, vital skin bounce in a flash. And I know this is really expensive and people really like the Sunday Riley CEO, so I'm excited to try that one. Okay, then I think everyone got this this time. This is the Makeup Forever Ultra HD Invisible Cover Foundation. Um, it's real orange on me. I tried it the other day. It was okay. I'll try it again. Um... I thought it was great that they put that they were brave enough to put a foundation in for all of us. Obviously, it's not going to match everyone perfectly, so I get it. But good sample. I'm happy with that. And then the last thing, which I did not think would be my favorite thing, uh, is the Urban Decay Quick Fix Hydro Charge Complexion Prep Priming Spray. And it, it's with niacinamide, coconut water, and, well, this doesn't sound good, Sepitonic M3. You know. Sepitonic M3, whatever. Uh, but so you use this as a primer spray. It says two ways to prep your skin. Uh, it's for when you need moisture, but also when you want to get rid of oil and shine because it balances out complexion and it absorbs oil. And so I've put this on the last couple of days and I really, really sorry I'm reading the little thing that you can't see in frame I really like it it also says after a clinical study a hundred percent of participants had a reduction in pore visibility yes please um, and a hundred percent had a visible improvement in skin radiance and as with all urban sprays it has a beautiful fine mist that all the other sprays don't have um, so super, super love that. And just caught my neighbor staring at me doing this. She's got a thing over. It's like mid afternoon. She's, she's right. This is weird. It's okay. Um, it also smells like sun bum, uh, suntan lotion. So that's just a nice bonus. And of course you get your 50 buter, buter, 50 beauty insider points. So I'm excited to go use that uh on what not quite sure yet but we'll be using it soon as if there aren't enough holiday sets coming up um i will definitely be putting this to good use so that is it for this video it's a quick one um let me know what did you get in your subscription boxes this month what was your favorite thing you got please please leave a comment i want to chat with you leave a comment let me know what you really enjoyed um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!